السلام علیکم فرینڈس ان ٹو ڈے لیکچر وی ول ایویلویٹ دی انٹیگریشن فرام زیرو ٹو انفینیٹی ایکس اسکوائر ای ٹو دی پاور مائنس ٹو ایکس اسکوائر ڈی ایکس ان ٹو ڈے لیکچر وی ول سالو دس انٹیگریشن ان آڈر ٹو سالو دس انٹیگریشن لیٹ سپوز ٹو ایکس اسکوائر از ایکول ٹو ٹی اینڈ ایکس اسکوائر از ایکول ٹو ٹی ڈیوائڈیڈ بائی ٹو ایکس از ایکول ٹو ٹی ڈیوائڈیڈ بائی ٹو ہاف ڈی ایکس ول بی ایکول ٹو ہاف ٹی بائی ٹو ٹو دی پاور مائنس ہاف اینڈ ہاف ڈی ٹی دس از دی ڈیرویٹو آف دس اکویشن ناؤ دس کین بی ریٹرن ایز دیٹ ہاف ان ٹو ٹی ٹو دی پاور مائنس ہاف ڈیوائڈیڈ بائی ٹو ٹو دی پاور مائنس ہاف اینڈ ہاف ڈی ٹی ناؤ دس کین بی ریٹرن ایز دیٹ ڈی ایکس از ایکول ٹو ہاف ٹی ٹو دی پاور مائنس ہاف انڈر روڈ ٹو دس ٹو ٹو دی پاور ہاف ہیز بین ریٹرن اوور ہیئر اینڈ ون اوور انڈر روڈ ٹو اینڈ انڈر روڈ ٹو ان ٹو ڈی ٹی دس ٹو ہیز بین ریٹرن اوور ہیئر از انڈر روڈ ٹو اینڈ انڈر روڈ ٹو ناؤ دس اینڈ دس ویل کینسل ایچ ادر and we will get dx is equal to half t to the power minus half divided by under root 2 and dt this is equal to dx now the given integration will become equal to under root from 0 to infinity x to the power 2 e to the power minus 2 x square dx is equal to integration from 0 to infinity t divided by 2 e to the power minus t t to the power minus half divided by 2 under root 2 dt this integration will become like this one now it can be written as that 1 over 4 under root 2 integration from 0 to infinity t to the power half e to the power minus t dt this integration can be written as like this one here this is t to the power 1 and this is t to the power minus half so it will become equal to 1 minus half is equal to t to the power half so we will get this term and e to the power t is this one these two and these two will become equal to 4 and this term has been written over here so we will get this equation now this equation can be written as that 1 over 4 under root 2 integration from 0 to infinity t to the power 3 by 2 minus 1 e to the power minus t into d t this t to the power 3 by 2 minus 1 is equal to t to the power half so this term has been written over here now friends we know that the definition of gamma function is equal to gamma n is equal to integration from 0 to infinity x to the power n minus 1 e to the power minus x d x this is the definition of gamma function if we compare this equation and this equation then the value of n is 3 by 2 so by using the definition of gamma function this equation will become equal to integration from 0 to infinity x square e to the power minus 2 x square dx will become equal to 1 over 4 under root 2 gamma 3 by So this is gamma 3 by 2. According to this definition, this term is become equal to gamma 3 by 2. And this can be written as that 1 over 4 under root 2 gamma 1 over 2 plus 1. This term has been written as that gamma half plus 1. Now according to the property of gamma function n plus 1 is equal to n gamma n so this term will become equal to half gamma half so the given equation will become equal to 
integration from 0 to infinity x square e to the power minus 2 x square dx will become equal to 1 over 4 under root 2 half gamma half. This will become equal to this. Now, it can be written as that 1 over 8 under root 2 and we know that gamma half is equal to under root pi. So, this given integration will become equal to this one or we can write it as that integration from 0 to infinity x square e to the power minus 2 x square under root 2 pi divided by 16. This term can be written like this one. How this term is equal to this one? If we multiply and divide this term by 2, then it will become equal to 2 divided by 16 under root 2 under root pi. Now, these two can be written as that under root 2 and under root 2 under root pi divided by 16 under root 2. So, this under root 2 or this will cancel and we will get under root 2 pi divided by 16. So, this is the required solution of this given equation. Thank you.